Hi, I'm Ben Kisley, and this is our ECE 1161 Embedded Systems 2 project. It's a gesture security for Android phones, so it's basically a lock screen based on what you draw. And it's based on the metrics of what you draw, so it's based on things such as width, height, drawing time, the shape of the object, um, the pressure, the finger size, and the orientation. So I'm going to show you, this is the password setup screen. So I'll draw a gesture 10 times and it will average each gesture into one average shape to be used for the profile for passing and failing gestures. So I'll just draw this gesture right here 10 times. And as it's doing this, each gesture is being stored into a SQLite database. And at the end, each database is queried and one average shape is created. Okay, so first I'll show you a pass. But before that, I'll show you what each of these buttons do. The password setup takes you back to that screen I was just at where it creates a new user profile. And the emergency call button takes you to an emergency dialer where you can make emergency calls if you can't get into your phone. Okay, so I'll show you a pass first. So I'll draw that gesture I just drew right there. And because of that, it closed the lock screen. There was another lock screen open behind that. That's why this happened. But here, I'll show you another pass. And this is what happens. It, it closes the lock screen. OK. So now, to demonstrate a fail, I'll give the phone to my partner, Vikram, and show you a fail. Okay, so there he goes. As you can see, it was a fail, exactly how it should have. And that was due to less than half of the metrics passing. And each metric is given a weight. The heavier weighted metrics are things that are harder to reproduce, such as finger size and drawing time. Things that hackers won't really be looking for or that are harder to reproduce. Things such as the width and height, a hacker can look at that and actually reproduce it. So in this case, the reason for uh, failure is I held the phone in a at a different angle. And also, my finger size is naturally different from Ben's finger size. And uh, and also the shape, even though it is similar to what Ben uh, Ben did, there were sufficient amount of variations uh, for the decision making algorithm to declare it as a failure. So and also the the width is a little different, even though the shape is very similar. The width is uh, a little different from what uh, Ben drew when he was setting up the password, and that is one. Of, uh, the, those are the reasons why the total uh, the net decision making. Uh, algorithms uh, metric uh, added up to be less than half which uh, resulted in a failure so let me try it one more time to see if I can uh, uh, hack into this uh, system so a second try as you can see it's it's a fail again mm -hmm. yep. and le le uh, let me try uh, to be a really smart hacker and then try and maybe change the orientation of the phone and then see if that uh, decision, uh, that metric added into the total decision making algorithm would help me uh, crack the, the core, uh, uh, crack the lock screen. So now I'm gonna try and shift the orientation to the orientation that he used and I'm gonna have another go. It still failed. Mm -hmm. As you can see, the reason is the orientation is right, but everything else has still failed, simply because I'm not the same person as Ben. As you can see from the face, <laughs> yep. it's very really different to Ben's face. Uh, let me try that one final time to see if I can actually uh, reproduce uh, Ben's signature. No. So yeah, it works. As you can see, the sh shape did pass. Uh, or it failed. Oh, is this, no, the shape. Oh, shape. Passed, just the yes. shape passed, but everything else failed except for the height, 
and I still couldn't uh, get through. So I guess that's uh, a good uh, demonstration showing that this uh, gesture does work. Maybe, may, you know what, uh, I'll hand over the phone to Ben one more time to see if we can get through and then uh, really drive home the point that we have the greatest gesture security based application Okay, here we in go. In the school. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> see if we can get this to pass. We're going to set the bar pretty low. There we go. It passed. Yeah. So Ben so passed. In conclusion, this is... Vikram's <laughs> didn't pass. So in conclusion, this is a pretty good lock screen. Maybe better than something such as a passcode or a simple, drawing a simple pattern, which can be easily observed from a hacker's point of view. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you again.